Hi everyone. Well, some time has passed, but we're going to do a tasting of all the stuff in the Tokyo Treat Box. This is from our merch box. Um, so we're starting things off with the Kalbi Osaka Ginger Tempura Flavor. We're going to Osaka. Red Pickled Ginger Tempura is no Continue. As Osaka soul food, and you can get you get to enjoy it in savory and slightly sour potato chip form with these Kalbi treats. Here it. Mm, I taste the ginger. It's just look kind of like. Salty chips with a hint of ginger flavoring. Yeah, it tastes, it reminds me of like a, almost like an all dressed or like a barbecue chips. A bit. A seven. I'll give it a six. It's, there's some flavor there, but it's not crazy flavor. Let's go right on to these. Pancake. Okay. Um, those are actually called Dora Choco Pancakes. Chocolate? Yes, please. We're into these reinvented Japanese traditional treats called Dora Yaki. Cakey pancakes that are filled with tasty chocolate. Uh, and they're like, literally like a... Little pancake. Little pancake. And it's got chocolate in the middle between the two pancakes. Cheers. This tastes like Pancakes with Nutella. I I I feel like, like a almost like a Twinkie vibe from it with Nutella. It's really good. What did you think of the of the pancake things out of ten? Mm, six. I'll give it. A, I'd give it a solid eight. I like those. Okay. Well, this is the first time that, like, they're actually, they're actually quite, they're actually bigger than what's on the package. Like, that's a pretty big, pretty big, uh, cracker. Or crisp, what are they? Cheers. Yeah, have crackers. Mm, they were like corn pops. Yeah. There's almost but, like a little, like a cheesy taste to them. I guess it's the bean? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. What, does, what do you think out of 10? I don't really like that. Don't really like it? I, I'd give it another 8. I really enjoy these too. These are Don Don Yaki sauce flavor. They're Don Don Yaki crackers. And they're supposed to be so good that we won't be able to stop munching. Mm. Kind of look like croutons. Mm. So they're supposed to be saucy and sweet. Oh. Mm. Oh, those have a little bit of a kick to them. Do they? They also some flavor. they remind me of corn nuts. Yeah, kind of like something like corn nuts. Yeah, I kind of like those. Something you would have at Christmas. You know what I mean? Like that, it would be like in a bowl, like a next bowl. In your bits, nuts and bowl. Yeah, that's what I, that's what it tastes like to me. 
Is that shit up? I, I like that, those. I give it a seven. I like this better than the. So what would you give it? Hello beans. Mm, a seven. Seven. Okay, let's go. I have to cleanse the palate. Okay. Mm. Interesting. One of our favorites from Japan was. Well, these are Texas corn okonomiyaki. Okonomiyaki. No, I can never say it. It's okay. Okonomiyaki. So, what happens when Texas meets Japan? These awesome corn treats. Snack down on these light and crunchy treats with the flavor of rich and sweet Okonomiyaki sauce, which was one of my favorite sauces. Cheers. These again look like corn puffs. Oh, they definitely do taste like the sauce. Mm, if you eat a bunch of them, you definitely get the flavor. Like the first one I just tasted corn pop, but any a bunch you get the flavor of the sauce. It's real like these uh nine, nine mm, out of ten. I like those. They're like Cheetos kind of. Yeah. I like if you give me a bag of those I'd be I'd be okay with that. It's a nine for me. What would you give? Mm, an eight and a half. What would you choose next? Mm, let's do something sweet. Okay. We have this little marshmallow. Okay. Mm. It's called a pudding. The fuku. The flush. Oh, this is a fluffy marshmallow with a sweet and creamy pudding filling. I guess it's I'm cutting it then. Interesting. Oh, that's kind of cool because it looks like like an egg inside. So it's got like a yellow filling, so it's like an egg. Pretty, pretty nifty. Sweet and creamy. Cheers. Mm. It's like custard. Mm. Yeah, it has kind of like a very, very sweet, like almost ice cream flavor to it. I give that probably nine, nine out of ten. Very close to a ten for me. It's closer to a ten than an eight. Mm. Mm. An eight. Eight. It's kind of small. That's true. This is. Ooh, I think I need your help on this one. Oh, my boo. Tonat, tonkatsu sauce, sauce flavor. flavor. It's the most iconic flavor. Sweet and spicy tonkatsu is pork cutlet sauce flavor. This crunchy corn snack that will ha whoa, have you drooling. That's crazy. It's just like one stick. Do you want the end or the middle? Mid. Mm. Kind of smells a little funny. It smells fishy. Does it? it just smells barbecue to me. Nah, I don't really like that. I thought it was. No. Mm. That's like a. Six to me, maybe seven. Two. Two. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna open this baby up. So that each uh, box comes with one drink in it. Okay, this and might just spray us because I did shake it to kind of loosen Ashi things up. Ashi melon cream soda, milky Japanese soda. So it has a sweet, sweet, creamy flavor. Of vanilla ice cream. Cr 
Chris loved the melon sodas in Japan, so I'm guessing he's really gonna like this. That's so good. That's really good. I'm, on the other hand, not a big fan of anything melon, so... That's a 10 for me. Yeah, ooh, the smell of it's already not... Yeah, oh no. I just don't like melon. Not good for me, but good for me. It's good he likes it. I actually saw this was gonna come in the box, and I was really excited because the melon sodas were his favorite. These, uh, Hickories. Yeah, these are hickory German potato flavor. Germany in. In uh, Japanese treats, pretzel. Ooh, uh, it's a pretzel stick. I can't get it over. It's supposed to be the flavor of yummy German potatoes. So, always a very interesting packaging. Oh my God! A chop. Kind of like a Ritz cracker. Yeah. Not really tasting potato. No. It's good. Mm. I like them. I'd say like a five. Hmm. I'll give it a six. So this is Baby Kakimoshi, a treat for both kids and grown-ups alike. These salty and fluffy rice cracker treats make the perfect addition to any bento box. Mmm, that to me it kind of tastes like seaweed. Right. There's a green um, flavoring on them. I I like them. They're not too strong. There's a little tiny aftertaste. I think it's seaweed. Maybe. But I I like them. They're pretty light compared to like chips. So yeah. I give them a six. Yeah. Tiny package. Um, this is these are the taro beans. Oh, those are salty. All right. Mm -hmm. Again, like a lot like a. Kind of a coronet taste. I find them like those, you know, those little pylon. What are those? Bugles. Bugles. Very much like a bugle. I don't yes, really. Yes, I agree. Yeah, I don't really taste the bean, but I get those a. Yeah. Five. Yeah, I'm not a big. No, maybe fan of bugles. I'll bounce it up to a six because I would probably eat those. Probably four for me. I don't think I would. Eat those very often. Um, so these are the Pringles Miso Cup Ramen Flavor. Tastes like ramen. I get those an eight. They have, kind of have the soy sauce flavor to it almost. Did you 
Japan has a ton of flavors of Kit Kats. And the color of it. We've tried uh, quite a few varieties when we were there. I still have to check my mouth. Take your time. I'm hoping this is going to taste really good. Yeah. Smells like peach. You didn't even smell it. Mmm. That's good. Tastes like pan. peach. Tastes a lot like fuzzy peaches. Yeah, that's really good. Those are really good. Let's let's go from something that I really like to something I probably am not gonna like. These. They're melon Pandoro cookies. A crunchy sweet snack with a fresh melon flavor to get you in the spring mood. Probably not gonna like them. I'll give you more. Definitely you can smell the melon already. Oh. Yep. Nope. Not a fan? Not a fan. Mm -mm. Uh, the cookies are really good though. Yeah. I could have been an eight. A different flavor, it would be better. But that's a two for me. Uh, so next we have caramel corn. Um, Hina Matsuri peach flavor caramel So I'm going to try the pink ones and then the white ones. Mm, this reminds me of Tokyo Disney because they have flavored popcorn. Mm, that was so good. Mm. Not an overwhelming flavor, but... No, it's nice. But yeah, very nice. Enjoy it. I like this. I give this an eight. There's to be a nine for me. Mm. So we've got these little... Plenty of little things. This is. I think that's the. Yep. Spicy Japanese. No, no, it's at the. Oh, yeah. Uh, yakisoba taro. Noodle goodness. Yakisoba inspired snacks. Also says you could add hot water to them. That's interesting. Like they turn into almost like a noodle. There is smell. Yeah. Just gonna pour a little bit into your hand. So we like Cheers. something you would put on a salad or something. It's almost peanut-y. Hmm. It's different. Not really a big fan. It's, almost, it's a little too tough. I can see why you would put it with the water and try and water it down and make it softer. I really like the flavor. I give that a six. Yeah. It was a five. Don't love it, don't hate it. These are like beer nuts, for sure. Ooh, they, they're spicy. 
Mm. Yeah, definitely got a kick. Yep, spicy. Not a huge fan, probably like a five for me. Too spicy. Three. And the last thing, uh, this was actually a bonus to our box. Um, so it's another flavored Kit Kat, chestnut flavored, which I'm really intrigued to try this. So this thing is the best See. See what it tastes like. Mm, I feel like almost maple look to it. <laughs> almost like a milk chocolate cream. Like a cookies and cream flavor almost. Mm -hmm. Without the cookie. Like an ice cream flavor. Yeah, I thought it would taste more nutty, but it doesn't really. Hmm. I give it a ten. Ten out of ten for me. I give it a nine out of ten. Okay. So Alice, what was your favorite Mm. Favorite, favorite thing? Yeah. Uh, the peach parfait. Kit yeah. Kats. For sure, hands down. I would say. Followed it's... pretty closely by these. I would say probably the peach parfait, followed by yeah, melon, melon soda. soda. Um, I really liked chestnut. I actually really liked the okonom okonomiyaki. I think those were my favorite of the salty things. What was your favorite salty thing? The mm, I, I like these chips that we tried first. Yeah? Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. Oh, overall, really happy with everything we got. Thank yeah. you, Alice. There was not many things. Mm -hmm. Fun birthday, Valentine's Day present. Stay tuned. We have more boxes to try. Good job.